New at 11 tonight, Alexandria police are investigating something that someone spotted inside a parked police cruiser. The chief of police has already issued an apology for what he's calling, quote, potentially offensive materials. News Force Derek Ward explains. Can't breathe. The video was posted two days ago on the site called Alexandria Accountability, described as a grassroots citizen journalism organization. It shows an unoccupied Alexandria City Police SUV parked at the intersection of North Patrick and Madison Streets. And it's what's inside that prompted the post. Can't breathe and then a pig head at the top there. Unbelievable. It shows a t-shirt with the phrase, I can't breathe, printed on it, draped over the front passenger seat, and what appears to be a pig mask mounted on the headrest. The phrase became a rallying cry against police brutality since incidents involving Eric Garner and George Floyd, two men who died while under illegal restraint by police officers. We got a highly inappropriate item in this vehicle. There's a t-shirt that says can't breathe. The video does not show who was assigned to that particular vehicle. A responding sergeant, who would eventually remove the t-shirt and mask, told a videographer that he did not know who the vehicle was assigned to. We definitely understand uh, the public's concerns. We, uh, uh, we find that to be very troubling. Assistant Police Chief Easton McDonald says the matter is being taken seriously. I uh, can tell you that we are investigating the matter. Uh, we're following our agency procedures, which is to contact the city attorney and the police auditor has been notified. The name of the officer assigned to the cruiser is not being released. The assistant chief says it's a personnel matter, but there is a public ramification. It's a matter of the optics. We've uh, spent a tremendous amount of time in the community building trust and legit legitimacy with, within the uh, community and our credibility. As for the citizen journalist's actions, that kind of vigilance is welcomed as long as it stays within the confines of the law, not interfering. What I would suggest to any citizen uh, for anything, whether it is uh, good behavior or it is poor behavior, uh, to follow the procedure, notify us, and allow, file your complaint and let us do what we have to do. And he says they often do get reports of the good behavior of city officers. Uh, we just had an officer just the other day help uh, push a car, a, a citizen's car, out of the way uh, and the damaged his Achilles. A joint written statement issued by Alexandria City Manager and the police chief references the investigation and apologizes for the, quote, nature of the material. In Alexandria, Derek Ward, News 4. Now, we've reached out to the man who posted that video on YouTube, and so far we're still waiting for a response from him.